Hi friends, I'm Rick Walker. Welcome to another episode of the SST Car Show. This is a very exciting episode because we're not only going to look back at some very interesting pieces of automotive history, right now we're going to look at the future, which is here right now. Flying cars have become a reality. They're not mainstream yet by any stretch of the imagination, but the world's very first flying car race is set to take place in South Australia. It's the Airspeeder Race. Here's our full report. This is the Airspeeder Mark III. The world's first look at this very exciting flying racing car. This is a landmark moment in the dawn of a new mobility revolution. The Airspeeder Mark III is a full-sized, remotely operated electric vehicle takeoff and landing vehicle. This vehicle will be one of at least 10 flying cars that will compete in a remotely piloted Airspeeder racing series. The series will serve as a technical test bed and feeder series to a manned racing series, which will take place in 2022. More than three years of development has gone into creating a sport that will accelerate a new clean air aerial mobility revolution. When we look back at pioneers like Ford and Rolls and Renault, Marcel Renault was a racing driver. Charles Rolls was a racing driver. Henry Ford was a racing driver and used his winnings from racing to start the Ford Motor Company. Uh, the first Fiat's were racing cars. The first Bentleys were racing cars. The first Mercedes was a racing car. It stands to reason that in this century, the first flying cars that, that truly change the world will be racing cars. These flying cars are being developed and manufactured by teams that draw talent from some of the leading names in aerospace, automotive, and motorsports technology. Names like McLaren, Babcock Aviation, Boeing, Jaguar Land Rover, Rolls-Royce, and Brabham. If all goes as planned in 2022, pilots will climb into the cockpit of this, the Mark IV. That's when the racing series will reach new heights with real pilots driving these flying cars. testing and the actual race series will provide information on vehicle dynamics, performance, safety and powertrain technology. That information will be used to speed up the development of electric vertical takeoff and landing vehicles that eventually might find their way into mainstream life and revolutionize urban mobility. In other words, flying cars might just become a common thing sooner than we think. This is Alice. She's a collector. She used to drive all over town looking for bargains. Until she discovered CollectorWarehouse.com. It's an amazing online market. Toys, old albums, tools, video games, genuine antiques. You name it, they've got it. No more driving. Now Alice buys direct from their website. Sometimes she registers for online auctions. You can too. CollectorWarehouse.com. The world's coolest collectibles. Turn back the hands of time with Antique Chevrolet Parts. Since 1971, we've been sourcing parts from around the world to help you restore and maintain antique chevs. No tail fins? We have your parts. Call us toll-free at 1-866-767-2787. Get help from a real person or go to AntiqueChev.com. Download a catalog. Order online. Delivered to your front door. Antique Chev, helping you turn back the hands of time. 